My name is Adam. I am 40 years old, and this event has haunted me for years. This story took place when I was 29. I was a new father and had the craziest sleep schedule. My wife and I had been trying to have a kid for years. Eventually, our little boy Eric came into our lives. It was a normal night like any other. My wife was rocking our baby boy to sleep while I was washing dishes from the dinner we just had. It was a rough couple of months for us, trying to adjust to parenting life. On this particular night, my wife and I went to sleep at 12 in the morning. Typically after our boy goes to bed, we always try to make time for each other and end up losing track of time. We were so tired, we fell asleep right when our heads hit the pillow. Around 2 a.m., I can hear Eric crying in the other room. Typically, we alternate nights on who checks up on the baby. I open my mouth and in a grumbly voice say to my wife, Your turn. I immediately fall back asleep, figuring that she probably woke up from the crying as well. After about 30 minutes, I was awakened again. This time, it was from singing. I lifted my head from the pillow and leaned in towards the baby monitor. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. I put my head back down on the pillow, thinking about how lucky I am to have her as my partner and how grateful I am that we have our baby. Listening to her voice made me sink deeper into my pillow and slowly drift back asleep. All of a sudden, I hear the doorknob turn. My wife walks through our bedroom door with a glass of water. She drops her glass of water onto the ground in horror after hearing the singing from the monitor as well. We both run to Eric's room and pick up our child. The window was left open with the wind furiously moving our curtains. We contact the police and explain what happened. They never found who the woman was that was singing in our boy's room. From that night on, Eric's crib was never in that room again. <laughs>